and Starly. Um, Highway Pigs. Or Highway Pegs on our Street 750. These highway crash bars are from DDH Studio. They are basic in design, simple to install, come with very few parts, and take very few tools to install. You'll need a H8 port and a 15 millimeter, and a ratcheting wrench, these are some additional parts that I'm adding to the Foolish Repeat. The bolts you'll be removing are the 15 millimeters here. So that's the engine, right? Is it's that by, the engine? It's by the engine. I did this one side at a time. You will not reuse the 15 millimeter bolts that are in the bike. The kit comes with torque bolts to reinstall. You will reuse the nuts. The nuts are specialty nuts that go on the back side. Um, they have a little clip that holds them to the bracket there. You can see it at the very top of the screen. All four nuts have that little bracket. Make sure you use thread locker. That's the cream. This is the left hand side highway bar and the H8 torque bolts that come with the kit and some washers. It's relatively a to the point install. Like I said, we're removing four bolts and installing four new ones that are longer to accommodate the highway crash bar. The highway bars come gloss black which matches the frame. The foot area tread is a little aggressive but okay. Um, that's my Lily. The bars fit the bike well. They don't protrude excessively. Uh, they come out far enough to protect the engine and do their job, all while providing an additional place to rest your feet. That's the wheel and that's my home. Here I am positioned on the bike. The highway pegs feel like they're going to make longer rides a lot more comfortable. If you have these on your street already, let me know below in the comments. And I hope you enjoyed the video.